I know it's one o'clock, but I was off today and I am just getting up. I was tired. So I'm making myself a cup of coffee. And I gotta make me some more salsa for my meal. So I thought I'd see what you guys are up to. Now this is going to be a posted video, not a live. So I'd love for you guys to um, just comment and let me know you watched it, you know. Um, that would be marvelous. Marvelous, marvelous. Okay. I have found this um, tastely, no, tastefully simple sugar-free syrup. And it is delicious in coffee. This particular flavor is mocha. I just put a little bit of that in there. Sweeten it up. And sometimes I put a little almond milk, but I'm not gonna put any almond milk in there today. And we're going to um, just stir this up a little bit. And I'm just going to put the little lid on it so it stays hot while I'm doing this. And I can drink it as I go. So what has been going on with you guys? I... I'm still on my weight loss journey. I haven't given up. See, this has, this is my chopper. And this, this is the blade that goes in there. It's extremely sharp. So I have to be real careful. This goes in there like that. It has a silicone rubber on the bottom so that it doesn't slide as easy on the counter. But yeah. I don't think I'm going to need both of these tomatoes. I got some huge tomatoes this time. I don't think I'm going to need both of them. Fresh tomatoes for my salsa. Gonna put it in there. And see what happens. Okay. Okay, big pieces in there, so I have to be kind of hard. I don't know if you've seen me do this before, but about one pull is seven times with that sharp blade. Makes easy work of chopping. And I have some I got three 
three jalapenos this time. So. I'm gonna leave some of the seeds, but not all of them. Cause I think the seeds give it a little bit of spiciness as well. Onion too. This is so easy to make, guys. And one of the things I found since I've been learning about how to eat better is organic fruits and vegetables. Um, I like them better. Um, for one thing, they're usually a little bit smaller because I can't eat, um, you know, a whole lot. It's just me. So smaller fruits and vegetables would be better for me. And so like you see this onion, usually onions are huge when you buy onion, but this is an organic onion. So it's a little smaller, more like the onions I remember my mom getting when I was a kid. When we were little, you know, I'm I'm over 50. And when I was younger, um, I don't remember seeing huge fruits and vegetables like that. You know, let me get a little sip here. I don't remember seeing huge fruits and vegetables. Oh, guys, mm, that is so good. Mm. I don't know if I have any coffee lovers out there. Okay, I'm gonna put some more tomato in there. Got another huge tomato here. So I'm going to cut it in half. Now this right here, this tomato is big, but this type of tomato is supposed to be big like this. I forget what it's called. You know, yeah, it's supposed to be big like this. So if I, I don't think I'm going to need the whole thing. I can put the rest in a salad because I'm going to make salad for lunches. I don't know what I'm going to do for dinners this week. I've got, I haven't had chicken in a while because I've been eating beef. So maybe I'll do some chicken and broccoli. I have a lot of green beans and cabbage. I do have enough cabbage in there. Just a little more 
use the rest of that tomato for my salad. chili powder this is a cumin I let the ancestors tell me what's enough <laughs> I know y'all tired of me saying that but I don't know I don't measure anything when I cook mm -hmm. and we also <laughs> We need a little lime juice, and I happen to have some this time. Oh, if I can get it open. Jesus, that was on there tight. Oh, who did that? I'll put a little bit of that in there. I don't know why I keep picking up that top. this time. They gotta need a little bit more lime. Oh yeah, after this sits overnight, this is gonna be spectacular. <clears throat> There you go, fresh salsa. Tastes delicious. I put it on everything, on my chicken, on my eggs, on my beef, my vegetables. It's delicious on everything. So we're gonna put that in the refrigerator. Make some salad now. Mm. 
and have some leftover bell pepper. I like it chunky in my salad because I like the taste of bell pepper so we need big chunky pieces. Probably won't need a whole onion. what I'll do is I'll um just cook me up some chicken breast to put in here let's see Why I'm always so messy. I always make a big mess. I don't know why. Alrighty. And I need some cucumber.
so I don't know if I told you guys, but I go to get weighed every two weeks. And as of now, I've lost, well, as of then, because that was Thursday, I've lost um, 15 pounds since November. And y'all, <laughs> it's something. It has been really hard because I like to snack. And. That's not something you can do when you're trying to do this diet. There is no snacking. You know? No potato chips. No M&M's. <laughs> None of that kind of stuff. All the stuff I love, nope, can't have it. And I can't say I haven't slipped since November because I have, but pretty much I haven't had any fast food. I haven't um, had very little sugar. Like I said, I've slipped a few times, but Nothing really makes a huge difference. So here's my salad. I'm just gonna stir it up. Get everything nice and mixed. Cucumbers, bell peppers, onions, romaine lettuce. Romaine lettuce is the only lettuce I like. So that's all you'll ever see me with. And like I said later on tonight, I'll cook some chicken to put in here. Okay, so I don't really know. Mm. You guys, this is the best coffee. I don't really know. Um, I got fish. I got to decide where I'm going to cook for my dinners this week. So I'm going to go for a minute and I shall return. Mm-hmm. 